And we're back to learning Inkscape and this time I'm going to show you how to adjust the sensitivity of the snapping. Let us first create simple objects, two rectangles and I'm going to drag a guide from left to right. So I have the rulers active, press ctrl R if you can't see them and then you can drag this guide. The general snapping is active and just keep the defaults. So our black rectangle snaps to the corner of the red one but only to the corner and it also snaps to the guide. So this is our starting point. When you go to File, Document Properties, and as the Snap function, just click on it. And you've got three options for objects, grids, and guides. Objects, let me set it to always snap. And you can see no matter where I drag the black rectangle, it always snaps to the red one. And with the slider, I can adjust the sensitivity of the snapping. So when you make it smaller, the distance where it snaps becomes smaller and vice versa. Don't make it too small or you might run into the problem of finding the correct spot. Something in between 10 and 20 should be fine. It's basically the same for grids and guides. Let me show you this for the guide that I've created as well. So I set it to always snap and it will attach to the guide and you can't detach it. And with the slider you can once again set the distance where it starts snapping. Don't make it too small here either. Keep in mind that the values under the slider are the relative values, so the zoom level doesn't make a difference. The snapping sensitivity will always be adjusted to it. And this uh, can change the sensitivity of the snapping in Inkscape. I hope this video was helpful. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.